Welcome everybody to this Deez Reverse Online video. We're going to be doing Dino the Light Briefings Episode 2 and we're going to be starting from the Midtown MPD Station. There are going to be 6 out of 6 briefings to collect and for the reward you'll be getting the Groove Shoulder of Korrigar. Uh, this is the Dresden Shevin style yes. shoulders. I'll be I showing you this time at the end of the video. So we are going to be going off the first briefing and it's called Dino Light 2 Vicky Vell. This briefing is going to be located uh, right here so we're going to mark on a map right there and it's going to be located on top of a building I'll be showing you where it is on the map once I get there and also leaving the time and name in the description below so uh, the briefing is going to be on top of a building but kind of in between uh, two different buildings or something like that and across from there uh, you'll see this bronze building that's how you know that you're in the right area or something like that so uh, I'm going to be showing you so I think that we are coming across to this I mean this gold type of building so uh, so it's going to be right near here and then we're going to go down and this is the building right here that we're going down to and it's going to be I think next to these uh, ventilators right there there is our briefing it's already in white but I will be playing you the audio after I've showed you where it, the briefing is on the map so on the map uh, I'm going to be showing you the whole map of Metropolis first and then we're going to zoom in and show you what my waypoint's close to so we're going to go ahead and zoom in and there is my waypoint and it's close to the daily planet so it's pretty close and uh, so now I'm going to be playing you the audio the first brief and this is called Vicky Vale Dying Light 2 This is Vicky Vale with a JLA watch on one of my personal favorite members of the Justice Society Alan Scott this dashing green lantern doesn't need a ring to channel the power of the mystical star heart along with Jay Garrick Alan Scott is the heart of the Justice Society working alongside Power Girl Captain Marvel Wildcat and more when not fighting intergalactic evil with the Green Lantern Corps so we are going to be going off the second briefing and it's called Dying Light 2 Vicky Vell this briefing is going to be located right around I would say this point here and that's where we're going to mark and also uh, it's going to be located on top of a roof so it's going to be next to or in between two antennas and I'm going to be leaving the time and name in the description below and I'll be showing you where it is on the map once I uh, get to the briefing so it's going to be like this circular building I think it's one of these and there it is there is our briefing and so it's in between two antennas and there's a ventilator or some sort of uh, air thing it looks like next to or behind it so I'm going to be showing you where it is on the map so on the map let me just show you the whole of Metropolis and then I'll be zooming in and telling you what my waypoint's close to so uh, let's zoom in and then see what it's close to so the first briefing was around there and it's not too far from the daily planet so after you've gotten the first briefing you just fly right there so it's only like two or three squares apart on the map something like that so I'm going to be going ahead and picking this briefing up This is Vicky Vale with JLA Watch on the Justice Society's big bad bruiser, Wildcat. A longtime member of the Justice Society, Wildcat has no metahuman powers, but remains a force to be reckoned with. Criminals are lucky to make even one round against this burly boxer. We asked how he would handle Brainiac and the scores of new villains. His response? With a one-two punch. I'm Vicky Vale. So we're going to be going off the third briefing which is called Dying Light 2 Vicky Vale and this briefing is going to be located on a rooftop uh, next to some like trees or plants or something like that and uh, so what, where it is is going to be high up on a roof and uh, across from it you'll be able to see uh, that two circular buildings that's uh, so I'll be showing you uh, where it is located on the map so uh, it's going to be located right up here the briefing or somewhat up here so we're going to just kind of uh, find the area first so uh, let's keep looking for it and it's just uh, down below right here and uh, so it's behind two uh, trees and these trees are kind of in between each other or something like that and there is our um, briefing right here and across from this building you can see like three I mean three of the circular buildings or something so that is where uh, you'll know that it's in the correct area so I'm going to be showing you where the briefing is on the map 
So on the map the briefing is located right here. There is my waypoint. I'm going to zoom out and then zoom in again just to show you the direct area. So here we have the whole of Metropolis. So I'm going to be zooming in right now and then there is my waypoint for the third briefing, uh, Vicky Vale 2 Dying Light. And it's quite close to the uh, Midtown MPD station and also the uh, bridge line as well. I'm going to be going ahead and picking this briefing up. I'm Vicky Vale and this is JLA Watch. On Hawkman and Hawk Girl, two birds of a feather fighting together with the Justice Society and the Justice League. Hawkman and Hawk Girl will not confirm, but rumor has it that even death cannot separate them for long. Instead, they are endlessly reincarnated to find each other again. Look for them flying high above Metropolis. We are going to be going off the Dying Light 2 Maggie Sawyer this briefing is going to be quite close uh, to the third briefing so it's just going to be two two squares upward on your map and then it's going to be a straight flight uh, like to towards the fourth briefing so the fourth briefing is going to be located on the like uh, gold or bronze uh, kind of looking building and it's going to be high up on top of the building so I'm going to be showing you where it is on the map before I pick up this briefing. So this is the Maggie Sawyer briefing, uh, fourth briefing. So uh, I'm going to be showing you the whole of Metropolis and then zooming in to my waypoint just to show you the exact location of the briefing. So there's my waypoint, I'm going to zoom in and then just show you the exact location where it is and then I'm going to go ahead and pick up this briefing. So there's my waypoint. saw you to all science police units. All units prepare for transport of the special containment unit. Even with Sinestro's ring close to drained, his powers of fear are no joke and his forces will be looking for him. So let's focus and leave the drama at home. It's go time people. We are going to be going off the fifth briefing which is called Dying Light 2 Lex Luthor. This briefing is going to be located on the ground and it is going to be located uh, next to a patch of trees and grass or something like that. Yeah, so uh, the so we're gonna head there, and then I'm gonna be leaving the time and name in the description below, and also um, just showing you where it is on the map and what areas it's close to. So we're gonna check our map and see how far we're getting. So it's just directly below here, and uh, the briefing is gonna be next to a gallery. So there's gonna be a, ga a gallery on the side of the briefing, and then there's also another building, but I don't really see a name of it, so I'm not really sure what kind it is but um so uh it so the briefing is in front of the gallery or on the side and so i'm going to be showing you where the uh fifth briefing is on the map this is the dying light 2 lex luthor so on the map uh here we have the whole of metropolis and then i'm going to zoom in and show you my waypoint and what it's close to so we're going to zoom in and then there is my waypoint so it's kind of next to a uh, bridge section and once you click uh, Midtown and then kind of uh, move move your waypoint, it's kind of in this area. So it's quite close uh, to um, the other da daily planet, isn't that far as well. So I'm going to be going ahead and picking this briefing up. Charity, this is Lex on the coded frequency. Report in on your attempt to infiltrate the science police. So far, they've proved remarkably resistant to our usual takeover policies. Perhaps the Green and Yellow Lantern Corps' war is the opening we need. Don't make me wait, or I'll replace you with another agent. I'm sure we'll be speaking soon. We are going to be going off to Dying Light 2 Superman. This will be the final briefing to complete your briefing collection. So uh, the briefing is going to be located on some weird shaped building which I'll show you. So it kind of looks like some weird pyramid type of thing. Uh, right in the sky or something. And it has this triangular thing uh, in the middle where the that's where the uh, briefing will be. I, I would say it looks like a triangular donut. Uh, like right in the middle is where your briefing will be. So what you want to do is go right up here and then just go straight in here. And that is where your briefing will be. It's already in white but I'm going to be showing you. Uh, where it is on the map and playing you the audio so, so I'm going to be showing you where the Dying Light 2 Superman briefing is on the map so on the map we have the whole of Metropolis 
and then I'm going to quickly zoom into my waypoint and then show you where my waypoint is and what areas it's close to. So we're going to zoom into my waypoint and then the areas it's close to is the daily planet because it's like four squares up and uh, it's quite close to the daily planet. So if you're trying to search for the briefing, just uh, kind of like go four squares down and where the bridge conjoins and then you can mark it on your map and that's where the uh, briefing will be, this last briefing, which is six briefing dialect to Lex Luthor. This is Superman. Alan, Jay, are you there? I'm at the Watchtower with Martian Manhunter. The JSA proximity alarm has been triggered. We've been unable to raise Captain Marvel in Condock, and Power Girl is in Smallville dealing with the fallout from Luther's Doomsday Experiment. Do you need JLA backup? Please respond. If no response to this hail, I will send in reinforcements. Again, please respond. I'm showing off the groove shoulders of Kruger. Uh, and this is the Dresden 7 shoulders for completing the Dying Light Episode 2 briefings. So these shoulders look quite uh, beefy and like uh, quite uh, like uh, big or something like for a character to wear. So it, it kind of looks pretty nice. I like the way that uh, you know the it kind of stands out as well. It does look pretty sweet and uh, also you can change it to three different types of colours depending on your slot 1, 2 and 3. So we're gonna, I'm gonna be trying to show you uh, my colors as well. So I really love that uh, it's kind of got these lights as well on the side. So we're gonna kind of take a look around all, all around view as well. So let me just try to change the colors and see how it stands out. And it's also depending on your uh, palette tab, like your main uh, colors is what it will look like as well. So um, I've got it set as red, uh, red and purple. So I'm gonna just change it around and see how it is. So we kind of got the pink, purple. So any kind of color really makes it look nice. Uh, so this is quite a nice style. If you've got a nice chest piece as well, like maybe a good armor, then it would look really nice. So I hope you enjoyed this video and thank you for watching.